Hey everyone, welcome to Cleese Backyard Woodworking. I'm David, and in today's video, I'm gonna talk about these Base Camp dust masks. So let me finish cleaning up here, and we'll get back inside and talk about these dust masks. All right, so I'm done cleaning up. And uh, in this video, I'm gonna talk about these dust masks. So have you been looking for a all around good quality dust mask? Well, the people at Base Camp contacted me and sent me their mask to review. So this is what this video is all about. So this is the Base Camp M Plus dust face mask. And I've been trying out for a few weeks now. I'm liking it very much. Works well when doing home renovations, woodworking, and even going out where masks are required because of the COVID and you put on these seal caps that would work for going out. So the uh, Base Camp company, they've been around since 2005 and they focus on protective safety masks and helmets for like bicycles and stuff like that. Base Camp became a well-known brand on Amazon in 2020 and they continue to bring quality personal safety protective gear. And this one here is their third generation M plus with mesh material for better breathability and these uh, one-way exhalation valves that efficiently decrease the humidity inside the mask and exhaust out the heat and water vapor and the carbon dioxide from your breathing. These masks come with a six layer active carbon filter for a 99% filtration efficiency and it uh, helps keep out the uh, particles of like dust, protection from odors and allergens. And if you use the uh, sealed caps you can use these masks out at the stores and protect yourself from the coronavirus so uh, let's go check out the mask and the package and uh, don't forget to hit that subscribe and like button so let's go look at what the package has all right so this m plus dust mask comes with two mesh masks and they had one filter in all right see Here's the second mask, already with a filter. We've got the exhalation valves. We have replacement filters. There are six of them in here. One, two, three, four, five, six. These are six layers. All right, active carbon filters, non-woven polypropylene. Second layer is melt blown. And we got an active charcoal cloth, another melt blown BFE, uh, hot air cotton, and non woven polypropylene. So 99% efficiency. Comes with the uh, sealed caps. Exhalation valve caps prevents harmful exhalation from leaving the mask. So this will help protect others if for some reason you have the coronavirus or some kind of virus and it doesn't come out of your mask and that you don't spread the germs. We got caps for each mask. And we have this over the head strap that I'll go into a little bit further. Okay. It's the adjustable elastic band. Goes over your ear loop, over your head. That's optional. It's for better comfort. So that is the two mask package that they have. They also sell other packages. I'll leave links in the description below. So these masks are designed for excellent sealing and comfort with a nice nose uh, clip here. Uh, you can hand wash these and air dry them. It'll help save you another dust mask when the one use dust mask help out with the environment on those. We got easy Velcro fastening. Got the ear loops. Uh, usually the lifespan on these. So on here they uh, they estimate about 20-30 hours of continuous use and heavy dust exposure. It all it's all going to depend on your actual use of it. If you keep everything clean, if it's not as dusty, these can last pretty good. So these are great for particulates and grinding, sweeping, sanding, bagging, and mowing, vapors. Uh, contaminants, paint from painting, varnishings, 
uh, pollution, mechanic work, public safety work, and allergens also help when you're gardening and outdoor activities and from animal grooming. Alrighty, so I'll show you guys some clips of me using it for the last few weeks. And then I'll show you real quick on putting this on. All right, so now to put it on, make sure you have it opened. The filter is gonna cover your face because that's the important part. So you're just gonna put it over your nose. All right, like this. Make sure you get your ear loop. Other ear loop. And you take your straps with the Velcro sticking out and snugly put it on your back of your head. All right. Then you got a nice sealed fit. Make sure your nose is in there. You got a nice covered. Then you can breathe out. It's very com comfortable. And yeah, I've been liking these very much. And then when I put my safety glasses, and do an exhale they don't fog up like other masks do which is a big plus and i know i've been using all these other masks and all the and uh even though they seal real well they get very hot inside and these ones not as hot and very breathable and of course if it's hot outside the humidity it's going to be less humid than other masks are so that's another great plus so also as I said before, they have the elastic band, which is optional and can help some of the strap on your ear. I have it right here. All right, so you just feed it through the loop of the ears and bring it over your head. And then you can adjust the strap. I'll do that right now real quick. 
All right, so you unhook these, and then you uh, loop it over, loop it over the other ear, just like this. And you attach these clips. And these clips right here. Slide in there, lock into each other. That little clip. All right, so now you got this strap here. I would relieve it over your ears. So again, fit it over your nose. And get the ear loop. The other ear loop. All right, get the strap on. And you can bring over this strap over your head. Like that, and then you get a nice, better fit into your face. Make sure your nose is in there, sealed up. <sighs> Give some good breaths, <sighs> and your glasses don't fog up. Now, if there is a lot of humidity, it, it, you're gonna sweat on your eyebrows, and then your glasses you will usually fog up anyways. But as long as you're breathing and it doesn't fog up into your glasses then you're, you're really good to go. And it's more of a safety feature because then your eyes, you can see better and you're not constantly taking the glasses off, wiping it and wasting time. So now let's just quickly go over putting the valve caps on and changing the filter. And that'll be it for this video. So let's go and get into a, a closer shot. Okay, so now as you can see, the filter here. So we got these two ends here. And they have the close and open so to open it so just want to hold the front valve and then turn it counterclockwise just like that and this is going to pop out up there and you're going to see this little flap right here it's going to help with the seal of keeping out what you breathe in. So just want to make sure you have that there. And you can take this. Like that. So then you just remove the same on the other one. And put in a new filter. And then if you want to use these sealed caps. You're going to want to make sure you get the inside part. Get your seal flap so you have it in the right direction put that in there just like that and take your sealed cap and uh, line it up with the notches you're going to count the clock then you're going to tighten it going clockwise. All right. So now that you have that sealed. So you have, so when you breathe out, nothing would come out. It's filtered through the filter. All righty. So whether you're making sawdust or gardening now, since it is spring, this mask will be more comfortable and keep those particles out of your lungs. So uh, go check them out and their other products at bcmask.com. Uh, check out the links in the description below. I uh, hope you found this video helpful and until next time, I'll catch you later.